probably one was um, like you were definitely assigned to your mission, but remember that you're called to be a missionary wherever you go. So wherever you go, wherever you're assigned, the Lord is still going to put people in your path. And so definitely one for me was um, there was a woman and she um, was in her 70s, very old. Her brother was the first male baptized in Aruba. She lives in Bonaire. She's never accepted it, 29 years. She's still rejecting it. And um, my very first Sunday there, she just happened to decide she wanted to go to church. Her son was in the district presidency he was the branch president before and so she knew all the members she was never interested and she just decided to go to church and I met her when I looked at her I had this huge feeling that came over you are going to be the missionary to baptize her and of course I didn't know who this lady was I didn't know her story I'm just like that was weird um and then but she was being taught she decided to accept the missionary lessons that was a huge deal um to meet the missionaries the first time by the Dutch-speaking missionaries on or Bonaire. And that's the only area that they have Dutch-speaking missionaries in the whole ABC Islands is on Bonaire. And, but she also got super sick. She went to the hospital. When she came out of the hospital, her son came to me and he said, I feel she needs to be taught in Spanish. Of course, she speaks all four perfectly. So I'm like, okay. And we meet with her and she was baptized four weeks later on her birthday. And, um, she was just ready. Like I heard these like horror stories of how she like just rejected. She was totally against it. And she was just so open. She was ready. And she passed away the day I came home on my mission. And so she just barely had, just had enough time to um, join the church um, after like 29 years of rejecting it um, with so many fam- with her brother being the first member joined like in the ABC Islands and she still hadn't. And she, did it. So don't give up on people and make sure to follow those promptings. Um, her son came up to me later and told me afterwards that he felt prompted that I needed to be one to teach her. I really didn't feel I did that much. But if you, you're called to be a missionary and if you're doing what you're supposed to be doing and you're being who you're supposed to be, um, the Lord will bring you to people that you are supposed to meet wherever you go or signed.